All right, renovation update. Uh, so here's a big pump and holding tank that they're going to have to put in this hole here so that the bathroom behind this wall can work properly because it's on a ground level and the flush just never had enough, I don't know, I guess pressure or whatever it is. I'm not a plumber, but the flush wasn't working properly. That That toilet always got plugged. So the cheapest solution and the best solution would be to put one of these in. Uh, now what this does is you, you take a shit, it goes into this tank. Once it's in this tank, there's a blade that cuts up all your shit, your toilet paper, and then from another tube, it pumps it into the sewer. So it was about a thousand bucks and it was a lot less money than fucking with the pipes and, and doing whatever they needed to do to make the bathroom behind that wall work. Uh, as you can see, they did a little more digging, but I don't want to open it. It's a little dangerous there. They got to like set that in. Um, and I don't know where my dog is. Uh, we got a new little vanity combo for the bathroom. And it's just a cute little one, about 24 inches. Just, just simple, just simple. So that's, um, that's new. Uh, they kind of framed in the wall that they're going to put here to separate the garage from the laundry room. Uh, let's see if you guys can see it a little better. So yeah, that's, that's how it's going to kind of be. There's going to be a wall there and then we're going to put shelving on that wall, you know, for laundry stuff and, and whatever. And then, you know, behind the wall, on this side where the where the laundry machine is currently is going to be another part of the garage and they're going to actually take down this wall that you see in front of me. It's the hollow wall and it was just to make like a little work room in the garage but as you saw my grandfather filled it up with a bunch of crap. Um, <clears throat> now into the actual garage area they kind of framed, they put some framing here, um, they removed some hardware from this side of the garage door because it was broken uh, and the garage door actually just didn't work. The rails were all fucked up. Uh, that door, they left the rails and all that and that's and that's still, that still all works. Um, so that door opens. This door, you know, we're just gonna cut our losses and, and actually just seal it really nice, put a wall there um, and then make this room that, make this side of the room just more usable and, and um, uh, just a space that people want to be in, uh, maybe like a little hangout room, whatever. Uh, but this side will will be the remainder of of the garage, and will be where we keep our tools and and any garage stuff, a couple freezers and a fridge. And uh, that's the plan so far. Uh, they also ripped out more insulation, as you can see, and they're they're messing with the ducts and the fans, making sure that that the ducts are clean and. And yeah, there's just a lot of stuff. The workers brought a lot of stuff as well uh, when they came the other day, just just in preparation for tomorrow, because that's when they're gonna come and get like a lot of stuff done. Uh, they're gonna do some painting. They're they're gonna get some rooms going. Uh, but yeah, lots of work has been done, and I'm excited. I mean, you kind of can vision what it's gonna look like. I mean, at least in my head. But uh, I'm happy, and and I'm. I'm excited for you guys to kind of see what it's going to turn out and turn into. Uh, but yeah, lots to do. There's nothing much we've done in the other rooms, but let me show you this room here. Sorry, I dropped my joint. Um, so this was one of the old bedrooms that's getting just repainted. And as you can see, the floor is real freaking rough. Um, the baseboards are gross. Everything's not good in here. Closet is outdated. Um, so we're going to paint this all new floors, new lighting, all that, all that jazz. And this will be the, the main bedroom for the, the downstairs suite. And we got our paint. So the workers tomorrow, the, the situation is going to be that they're going to finish whatever they can in the garage before actually putting in drywall and stuff. And then <clears throat> they're going to do this room and paint it, just get it done. Um, and soon they're going to start the floors as well. In the kitchen area, we've done basically nothing except for purchase the sink. Uh, it's just one of those big, well, it's not that big, but it's just like a tub sink, stainless steel, just one little tub. Can't really fit much in here, so, but um, it's okay. It doesn't matter because we will have a dishwasher eventually. 